Hey everyone, Merrick's here, bringing you another video. Uh, so this is going to be maybe a little bit different than some of the videos I do. Uh, my buddy Evo asked me to run this, and I figured as long as I was going to run it, I would record it. Especially with uh, Flash Feud coming up, and the perk being 200% yellow gem damage. So you notice the strap has a 100% gem damage strap. However, um, with Feud uh, coming up, that's actually going to be... 200% yellow, so basically it, it would hit 100% harder than this, uh, even with only with, with a 0% strap, if that makes sense. Also, if you don't have the Nightmare Plate, uh, which adds 100%, this would be how hard Lita will hit this particular feud <clears throat> without the Nightmare Plate or 100% strap. Because of that 200% boost, that's your 200% right there. Um, so that's how this is how hard she would hit with just the metals um, equipped, uh, which is uh, full Fury 2s that are maxed. Uh, Entourage, you do need a middle line bonus for this. So this will only work with a middle line bonus, so keep that in mind. Uh, I believe the closest one to making it work is um, Trickster Lacey. She's two blue, one red. You would need a one red two blue MP trainer or um, Mr. Perfect. And then this would work without a middle line bonus, but this will work a uh, middle line bonus uh, for this feud. So 100% strap, but it's a yellow gem boost. So middle line bonus and Lawler, Andre, Santa Hogan, and uh, generate more yellow gems. Uh, so Booker T or Zombie Steamboat. The move charge is quite low, 4, 4, and, se uh, and 7. So 4 on these and 7 on those, right? So middle line gets you there with this setup. And um, the moves are the single leg monkey flip, 128k damage, choose 6 to make into yellow. Lead a DDT, 2 columns to make into multiply gems of strength 4. Lead a bomb, um, increase the strength of your multiply gems by 6. So this is straight up just a uh, gem damage build. Uh, so this would double at 6 star silver from what you're going to see. And again, uh, we'll hit much harder this feud with yellow. So, you know, if one of the two feuds, you got a middle line bonus and you got Lita, you don't even need the Nightmare Plate or 100% Strap. This is exactly how hard you would hit. You can see I'm one blue short. That's because I have no perks on this CC account, um, which I do on purpose. So I can easily simulate feud perks. So uh, just pretend this is a middle line and now we're starting uh, turn one right here. All right, so we're going to choose two columns. Um, we have two here and two here. We're going to boost it. Then we're just going to fill it in. So times 11s. I think we're going to be one short maybe or just get all of them. Yeah, one short this time. Um, so not ideal, but you're still going to see it should hit pretty hard. 11 million reduced to 10 million, and that's missing one of them. I'll run it one more time for you. So yeah, this should be very strong, this feud. Um, obviously, if you have a 100% strap in a Cody plate, it's going to be strong all the time. It does not recycle. Um, so I think if you get some decent yellow sub stats, and then you consider your gem boost that you get in feud... Um, I think if, assuming you connect all of them, 12, 13, 14 million, um, and doubling that. So somewhere between like 24 and 26 million would be pretty doable. It's also very quick. The only downside is, uh, like I said, needing that middle, uh, line bonus. And again, uh, not the best of luck with our lines, so we're going to be one short. But that's okay, because that's going to happen sometimes. Maybe I'll run one more, too, because this is really fast. That's the nice thing. It's a pretty fast build, too. There's a little bit of choosy-choos. I'm actually going to leave that red one. Uh, actually, no, let's leave the... Uh, let's leave the blue one. Just for funsies. Again, 11 million, reduced to 10. Let's see if I get one with all of them. I was hitting for 12 mil when I ran it, approximately. 
Again, this feud, this will smack. However, you will need a line bonus, middle line, one of the two feuds. Uh, first one would be your best bet where uh, Sonya is required. That's the only one that I can run a middle for the ladies this time. Second one is Powerhouse Bianca, the new one. Um, which I'm 40 shards away. I may get there before time is out. We'll see. Dang, didn't cooperate again. Oh well, it's me. What would you expect, right? It is fine. The nice thing is it's cascade proof, so I do like this build. Like I said, only downside is either needing Mr. Perfect uh, or having a middle line bonus. Of course, if you have Mr. Perfect, uh, then the other downside is the fact that um, you'll lose one on your multiply, but you wouldn't need a middle line. Again, 11 point some million. So I think you get the idea. I don't, eh, I mean, this has only been six minutes. For those people that want to see if I can get everyone, maybe I'll run just one more. Why not? Super fast. As long as I got this stuff on here, might as well do it. Two and two. Let's see if we can get a third one to drop in here. Nope. Not yet. It is not to be. That is okay. Of course, if you were worried about recycling, you could also put it in columns with a red and a blue, and then just do a row break, and you would be easily be able to recycle it, so... Ooh, little Cascady. Almost hit 12 mil that time. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Like I said, this is a little bit... Mm, maybe more on the rare side to pull off. Uh, but Lita's been around for a while. And with the big yellow bonus this feud, I thought it was probably worth showing. Um, as there's some people that could use it. And as long as my buddy wanted to see it, I figured I'd record it. So let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, remember to like, subscribe, and share. As that really helps me out. Other than that, guys, thanks for watching and good luck out there. Pretty impressive, really. Uh, she holds up pretty solid gem damage-wise. It was still uh, old feud perks, man. I wouldn't hesitate, actually, to take her silver and run that.